So hey guys, what's up? So welcome to World News 20 new channel. So let's talk about Scotland to be the first country to provide free pass tampons. Scotland is poised to become the first country to end period poverty by providing free standing to products to women all of all ages in the country. Free menstrual products are already available to the students in the high schools, colleges and universities in Scotland and the bill passed by the Scottish Parliament on Tuesday will make pads and tampons free across the board. Monica Lennon, the lawmaker who submitted a draft proposal of the bill, said she was thrilled that it had attracted support across Scotland, including from civic groups and individuals who had their own lived experience of the period poverty and know what it's like to not to have access to the products when they need them. Although the bill passed with 112 votes in favor of against the N1 abstention. Some lawmakers warned that the legislation faces a few hurdles before becoming a law, though they were regarded as a small table. One of those is really caused that the government puts at about $31 million. Tampons are taxed at 5% in Britain, a level that the British government has been unable to abolish because of the European Union rules that class energy products as luxury products. The bloc has pledged to remove all taxes on the maturation products by 2022. About £62 million pounds or $80 million collecting taxes on sales of the sanitary products in Britain has been divided to the women's charity since 2015. The Minister for the Civil Society Mims Davis said last year nearly 10% of the girls in the Britain have been unable to afford pure products and 19% have resorted to using substitutes like rags, newspapers and toilet paper because of the high cost. According to research by a girls' rights charity plan international UK, the provision of the free products is also aimed at combating the culture of the silence and stigma surrounding maturation, which the charity says that it can pose physical, sexual, mental health risk for young women. Nearly half of the girls aged 14 to 21 in Britain are embarrassed by their periods. The research from last women's groups criticized supermarkets for putting up anti shoplifting lifting messages across sanitary products yeah, warning that such campaigns stigmatize women who cannot afford the products. Peer poverty is an issue that affects women and girls across the UK with more than a quarter have missed work or school because they do not afford or didn't have access to the menstrual products and sell nowhere. The leader of the Women's Equality Party, a decade of the astrology, has pushed many women into a desperate financial situation. She said and many have been forced to use the makeshift tea items, shoplift or simply go without these basic necessities. So if you like the channel, so kindly subscribe to it.